Oh, that was worth it. Okay. <clears throat> if I could find a real life place that made me feel like Tiffany's, then I'd get some furniture and I'd give the cat a name. That was good. That was Audrey Hepburn. Is basic that you on your Halloween party because you're nailing it? That's so sweet, but no, that's next year, and I get to dress up like you. Ooh, burn. You got me. <laughs> but you do need to be careful tonight. There's pervs out, and they're wearing masks, so you can't as identify them as easily. Okay, well, there are pervs out every night. Yeah, but tonight they're wearing masks. Oh, my goodness. Thank you, Mom. Okay, well, you be careful. Seriously. Yes, handing candy to children is... Terrifying. Some of them could be dressed as little goblins. I kissed a goblin once. I think that should be a good kissing. I'm not really surprised by that about you. Yeah, yeah. I'm not even honest. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I wish you were going tonight. You're I know stupid. How I feel about Halloween. People in masks and dressing up, it freaks me out. I'd like to be home watching a movie. Oh my gosh, that's the most boring thing I've ever heard. I am a boring girl and I like to stay home and be safe and be boring. That's what I hear. I like to be boring and safe. A really fun combination. I think so. Thank you very I'm much. I'm so happy for you. You should be. <sighs> okay, but seriously, have fun in the best way you can. And uh, you know the rule, just don't open the door the last hour of midnight, you should be fine. No, what? I don't know what I'm talking about. The last hour of Halloween, you're not supposed to open the door. Why? Are you serious? Yeah. Ay, ay, ay. How did you ever live without me? <sighs> I have no idea. Okay. <laughs> the last hour of Halloween, 11 p.m. to midnight, is when demons and evil spirits are at their strongest. I'm serious. They're at their strongest, and they will try to get into your house. And if you open the door, I, I'm not kidding, they'll knock on your door, they'll knock on your window, and if you open the door and you let them in, you are giving them legal grounds to enter and wreak havoc on your life. You're just screwing with me. Come on. I'm not. Come I'm not, on. No, yeah. I'm really not screwing with you. No, I'm dead serious. I'm serious. My nanny told me this when I was a kid. My your nanny? Yes, she was from Bolivia, and that's where things like that happen. Or er, Mexico. It could have been Peru. It doesn't matter. She was from somewhere where they know about these things and it's real. My little brother and I on Halloween night, one night, it was 11.30 p.m. and we hear a knocking at the door and usually we can see outside from the window by the door if anybody's there and we don't see anybody and it's just knocking, knocking, and knocking. And so we go to answer the door and our nanny flips out, dude, like freaks. Never seen her like that before in our lives. She tells us to go into our rooms and lock the doors and to not come out. And we can hear her saying this prayer in Spanish like over and over and over again. She's walking up and down the house. She's saging everything. Meanwhile, the entire time, there's this knocking, 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 knocking. And then right at midnight, it just stops. I think your nanny was a little superstitious and those were trick-or-treaters knocking at your door. Okay. I don't think so. If there's anything I have learned in life, it is to take very seriously the things that your Mexican nanny is afraid of. Or Bolivian or whatever she was. Just do it. Well, I'm more concerned about you coming home in one piece. So, be safe, don't die, make smart choices. Thank you. I will be with Ashley, so I should be fine. But I'll call you if I need anything, and but I probably won't be home till 2. Go lightly into the world. Yep. Is there a good? Did you just make that up? I did. Okay. I'll give you that one. That Thank one you. was pretty good. Okay. Bye. Love you. Bye. Love you. I want to be home until I'm drunk. Very drunk indeed. You do this every year. And remember, don't open the door. Got it. Love you. Thank you. Bye. Love you. Hey, wake up! Hello? Please, come let me in, it's freezing. Give your keys! Sorry. And hurry, it's cold!
next time, I'm going to put you out here. Just open the door. Open the door. Thank you.